Hey, I'm David. I'm a volunteer at the Fort Greene Fridge and I'm here to do a cleaning shift. First thing I noticed is there's all this bread on the ground. So we're gonna go get a broom right now and sweep that up. So follow me. Here's where I get the broom. It's right over here. Yeah, hello everyone. I'm getting the broom to clean the fridge, okay? Ngao, ngao. That's thank you in, in Cantonese, I believe. There, and make sure I get all the stuff. Sometimes in the tree over here, there's, there's food and bread, and I try to get all the food out of here so it doesn't attract rats and flies or, you know, we want, we want this as clean as possible. So I do a sweep. So I'll set this aside. And now I have to go into Farmer in the Deli and get the cleaning bin. So follow me. Hi. He's on the phone. Thank you. I'll explain outside. In the bin, which I got it from Farmer in the Deli, I've got paper towels, I've got some gloves, I've got some cleaner, some glass cleaner, some produce bags in case there's any loose items I need to bag, and um, various other things. It's really neat in here today. So I'm gonna start with putting on some gloves. So I'll take these medium gloves here, put them on. The next thing I'm gonna do is kind of straighten up. I like to start with the dry pantry and I just kind of straighten things up and then wipe down the shelves as much as I can. Some of the shelves are kind of full right now, so I'll do what I can. And I'm gonna use this cleaner with the paper towels. Excuse me, I'm gonna go over here. These are our great neighbors that help out a lot. So, got some bread here. I'm just gonna wipe stuff down. I'm gonna leave this here. This looks pretty clean. Maybe I'll just clean the bottom shelves. They're a little dirty. So I kind of spray them over, organize the shelf, and just do a spray here and a spray here. And just kind of give it a wipe down. So I look at the fridge right now and I'm just gonna do a little organizing. We've got some meals here, check that. I always check the temperature. Right now it says 22 degrees, which is good to go. It's that thermometer back there. This light is a little loose, so I'll fiddle with that. And we have some pastries. Whoops, the light went off again. So I'm just kind of straightening things out. And then what I'm gonna do is I like to clean the bottom because that's like the dirtiest part of the fridge. So I'm gonna take all these baskets, these uh, bags of carrots, and kind of put them up here I want to get the big areas, the bottom and this here. The walls look pretty clean, so I'm just going to focus on the bottom, these ridges, and the doors and the handles. That's going to be my focus for today. Ooh, and we have kind of a yucky zucchini here. Uh, it, it's kind of on its last leg. My theory is I, I throw away anything I would need. That's my rule. So I, I, it's kind of ro uh, rotten here. So I'm going to throw this away and put that there to spray the bottom of this here and kind of do one half and then the other half. That's kind of my system. There's, these ridges, there's a lot of food that gets stuck in these ridges. So I make sure they're clean. I've done both shelves. Now I'm gonna do the outside windows and the door handles especially because they get touched a lot. And whenever we run out of supplies, if you have time, you can buy them from Farmer in the Deli and we'll reimburse you or um, they usually just give us paper towels. I try to give them money and they always refuse. So there's that light again. So if there's anything unusual while you're cleaning, you could always post something like, hey, I noticed the temperature's not right, or I noticed this, or there's cardboard boxes, or you can always post something on our Slack channel or Signal or um, email. There's lots of ways to get in touch with us. Clean down the fridge, clean down the pantry. I swept all around. I'm gonna put this back in the store on the counter where I got it. But before I do that, I need to do one more important thing, 
which is get rid of this box of trash. So follow me. So I got this box. It's very important this area stay clear because if we have boxes, it encourages dumping. Um, follow me. I'll show you where this goes. So all the boxes get broken down here and the trash we're just going to throw out over here. Um, so I'm going to throw this out here. That's my pen. And I'm going to break down this box and put it over there. And that's pretty much it. It usually takes about 15, 20 minutes. Um, so good luck and let us know if you, how it goes. Thanks.